What's up, gamers? Back. What's that? Is that the marijuana? Yeah. So nice. we get to smoke that. Actually, it uh blocks the bungees and the catapults. Nice, so it's, nice. it's not bad. Um, this is a pretty generic level, so we're just gonna choose generic plants. Nice. Nice. Actually, hey, where's sunflowers? Oh, yeah, I probably need those. <laughs> uh, let's do it there. I like to have them like close to my hot bar, otherwise I'll forget where they are. Mm. Um, um, hello, we. Uh, we don't need defensive plants. Those are lame. Give the. Yeah, well, we yeah. can just the squash will be for these guys. Actually, we'll do chili pepper. Red hot chili pepper. Z. Oh, mm. I mean zipper man. Z <laughs> Sticky fingers. Okay, back on the JoJo discussion. Uh, are we still having that? I mean, <laughs> what else is there to talk about? Up to you, but um, we kind of already finished it. I don't know. Just a few more things. If you're just this somehow This is a continuation of yeah. two weeks ago's discussion, which is bad form, but it's all right. Hey, who cares? If yeah, they're watching true. it in a series, like from a playlist, they'll... I don't know. I mean, a lot of people watch them, like, right off. Like, hey, Spencer's dad, do you care about JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? I hope so. <laughs> He's in it for the gameplay aspect. <laughs> um, but the final, final thing, I liked what they did with the stands. Did yeah, the, the head creative stands. I yeah, really liked that. That was good. All right, that's all we have to say. Okay, yeah, that. nice. Anyway, um, yeah, I think we've expired our stories, so... Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> cool. That's well, why I was going to talk about JoJo's more. Well, I, there mm. just wasn't a whole lot to talk about. IMO, my opinion... Especially when you talk about it so much, you know. Oh yes, I just constantly talking about it. <laughs> uh, <coughs> this is the finale something. of Plants vs Zombies, by the way. Oh, uh, so let's talk about the series. Yeah. So retrospective. Oh crap! Now that we're done with Plants, we're gonna have to find another series to tell our stories on. Cause Undertale Genocide Run. Well, you're gonna have to focus some <laughs> boring. On some of it, most That's of it's true. just grinding out enemies, which takes grinding time. enemies. It's gonna be a short series. Yeah, so that's not a permanent solution. I guess none of it is permanent, but it's not a long-term solution. What do you mean? Like Plants vs Zombies lasted what six months? Genocide is gonna a last is about three. Um, I thought this series. I mean, when it was like in its infancy, it wasn't amazing, but oh no. Because I didn't really want to do it. I only did it because, you know, Spencer didn't want to do it. Oh, I thought you wanted to. I mean, I I figured that I could save this series from being a Dalton and Spencer series. So I figured I could save it from being bad. Um, <laughs> hey, no our, offense. our galaxy was good. Oh. Well, you're taking that's, Galaxy that's 2 about away it. from us. Is Galaxy your only example, Dalton? Well, I, I have to look at what other series we're even doing. Like, I know Astral Chain's not gonna be a great example. Fingers crossed. You never know. Oh, it could be good. Um, I doubt it, but... Let's see. You'd, uh, you'd have to pull up a playlist, because I forget what we've done. Let's pull up all of our stuff that we've ever done on YouTube.com. Yeah, so... I know we did the marble it up, and that was really good discussion. Oh yeah, that was. Did you guys finish that? We. Yeah, you did. It's kind of weird because they're still updating it, so I mean, we've never really finished it, and I think they've added more levels. So if you guys want to see us play marble it up, comment. But. Mm. Um, yeah, you guys really haven't done that many series together. It was mostly just Galaxy that we did for yeah. so long. Our supreme playlist with all of our stuff. So you guys did Bed Wars originally. Well, that um, barely counted. That's, that uh, was like a two episode, two off. Yeah, we were the ones with the main series. So we actually did. Stuff. I was gonna say, well, you and I, I it, it just kind of worked out that like the stuff that we did was really good. Hmm. Um, we used to do a lot of Mario Party. 
Mario Party was fun, but it's like kind of like Wii Sports. It ran its course, so it was like it was good while we had it. It was, yeah. Hmm. Um. Oh, I oh, remember when we did Fortnite episodes? Oh God. <laughs> Try not to. Remember when we did Overwatch episodes? I try not to. <laughs> though, well, okay, we didn't... Those weren't really a planned thing, though. We kind of did those because we were like, hey, we need two episodes, like, right now. All right, let's play Overwatch. And I, they turned out nicely, too. It wasn't like... Yeah, it wasn't well, bad. They, they turned out slightly above average. Like, it wasn't... Mm -hmm. Whatever, but... Hmm... Hmm. Yeah, you guys really didn't do anything other than Galaxy. Also, our playlists are out of date. We did, okay, so... Out of all of our recent games, we did Marble Blast, which wasn't mm -hmm. amazing. Um, and we did... Oh, we're almost caught up, buddy. And I've only seen those two. Is Galaxy still going on? No, it's not. And we've started. No, no, it, it's this far in the playlist, and we've oh. we, we've started doing Lovers of Aether. So, it's that's pretty recent. The first two Lovers episodes were great. <laughs> like those, I want to. Okay, I actually have a playlist called Dalton's Hand Picks. If you've ever seen that. Yeah, yeah. Um. Yeah, my roommate looked at me weird when I was editing. <laughs> Hmm. You started Fire Emblem 7, that's one. Oh yeah, Fire Emblem. That one's been okay, I mean. But yeah, anyway, back to... Yeah, that's pretty plans. much about it, wow. Really not that much. Hmm. We got, well, it's the, mainly the games that we have done have been longer, like... Um... But yeah, as far as this series goes, like I said, I thought it was, it didn't start out the best, but I thought as it went on, and I, I think that, like, we really hit our mark on the, um, like, I think seventh episode, maybe. I liked the Marvel one that we did was probably Yeah, the Marvel one. one was, like, I think the eighth one. That one was good. Oh, uh, yeah, that one turned out well. I um, feel like this is the opposite of, like, our Odyssey or, like, our Sunshine, where, like, the first ones were good in those series, then it kind of went downhill. Odyssey was interesting. Sunshine, I would agree, where it definitely went downhill. Um, but Odyssey was like, it stayed good. It was just a different kind of good throughout. Oh, yeah. It's subjective. Odyssey was my favorite series, personally, that we've done. But Yeah, it was good. I just didn't want to play it as the time went on. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, why not, though? You were doing well. I, I don't know. Just, I guess I just got tired <laughs> of it. Yeah, I getcha. Too much of a good thing, I guess. Now, Luigi's Mansion, I said this in the series, um, but hot take, I think that I like it more than I like Odyssey. Mm. And I haven't even finished it. I've just done two episodes the in. The aesthetic of the game, the, uh, the feel, the controls... I'm just more of a Luigi's Mansion fan than I'm a 3D Mario fan. Because I grew up <laughs> on Luigi's Mansion. But it, it's just fun, too. Because, you know, Odyssey, that was fun. You know, you're learning God. the maneuverability, but nothing's better than sucking up ghosts with <laughs> Luigi's personality. And <laughs> Mario's kind of bland. Can you do? I mean, Mario is like the definition of a video game protagonist. Like, <laughs> he yeah. exists pretty much. He exists to exist. That is his. Then we get this, which is the most useless plant in the game. Oh, nice. What it produces it do? coins. Doesn't help you in any gameplay aspect whatsoever, but it <clears> gives <throat> you coins. And people have found out how to farm like 4,000 per second or something. I don't know. Wow. Oh, frick. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. So these guys are so tough that you can't kill them with a single squash, pepper, or cherry. How many does it take? Two, but oh. it still <laughs> takes two. Um, it takes two to make a thing go right. Um, 
I'm trying to remember. I think you can delete these guys with spike wheels. They, they can't smash them. Anyway, um, yeah, honestly, I kind of have to ask the question of has our channel improved over time? Like, can you confidently say that yes, we are better now than we were six months ago? Um, honestly, recording wise, um, quality of like, I don't know, just all the episodes look like the audio and video aspect has definitely well improved. of course that's improved um but commentary? i feel like it has but we've hit the aspect of even though we're doing better youtube isn't going to recommend us because we've we definitely have especially spectrum, with yeah. this type of series like a let's play channel we definitely mm -hmm. have to put ourselves out there and it's yeah. not super easy because we don't really um, have a definitive thing that we can put <coughs> out there yeah. right yeah well and it's like I, I've mentioned this before, but it's it's the difference between, like, um, me wanting to do, or me, like, recommending Great Blue to people versus me recommending Just Some Boys to people, and it's like, with Great Blue, I can pick about every other video, and it's going to be a very good representation of what my channel's about. With Just Some Boys, like, what am I gonna pick? Like, Super Mario Odyssey Episode 7? Like, very specific thing, and I don't... It's very hard to market a, uh... Especially nowadays, um because you're you know, there's just so many of them. Which I I personally have a lot of questions about like the success of this channel. I know it's good to like have some hope and say like yeah, if I can certainly make this work. I just I'm not sure personally between our schedules between the views that we're getting i don't think that we're going to have the motivation to continue this all the way until the end of not the end but until we <laughs> were able to make it big yeah. um which can i would i be able to do that with great blue maybe still not entirely sure but well yeah that's because it's solo so that's a little bit easier on your end well and it's like solo has a yeah, it's a double-edged sword, because it's like, I don't have to rely on anyone else to record. I can basically just say, yeah, I'm going to record something today and do it. But on the other hand, I have to carry the entire episode on my own, which is not as easy as it sounds, because, like, you and I can have a conversation for 20 minutes, and that's the episode, and that works. Yeah. But me on my own, I it, tr to try to comment on things and make it entertaining and not just talk about, like, hey, this is what's happening right now is not as easy as it sounds and if i can call simon out for a moment i think that that's not necessarily something that he's learned because a mm. lot of his commentary and by a lot i mean like probably 95 percent of it is talking about what is currently happening in the game he's playing and there's nothing like super wrong with that but people have eyes they can tell what's happening in the game they're playing <laughs> Um, I mean, scripting is also easier for quality-wise, um, solo. Scripting is, um, but I, I feel like a lot of the, the gaming channels that are making it nowadays are not necessarily Let's Play, but they're more of, like, like one-offs. The, the, yeah, the so Scott like, the Wazes of the YouTube. Sc Scott right? the Waz, I wouldn't say, because he, he does more informative things. I'm talking about people who actually play the games. Oh. um take like video game donkey for instance oh. like all of all of his things are um like one-offs he, he very rarely plays the same game twice and if he does it's because um he's like coming back or there's something different about the game Naturally, to show. yeah well <laughs> i mean yeah I, um, yeah i feel like our genre of this type of youtube is dying it is dying um but I certainly think we can still make it work because if, like, you take, well, I guess I, that also brings the question of did these channels get big while it was popular, but, um, channels like Alpha Rad, I know Game Grumps has been big for a while, so I don't want to say that, but, um, or not Alpha, but, uh, Blob. Um. Blob got big because of Alpha Rad. Right. So maybe I can get big because of Great Blue, who knows? <laughs> um. But, I don't know, I, I feel like if we're still getting the amount of views 
and interaction that we have right now in like I don't know is consistent over the next few months I I say that we'll start thinking about it then because I don't want to keep you know right making a bunch of content I don't want to beat a dead if, horse if no one's actually care about it you know my okay so my thoughts are that we keep doing this for fun even if we know it's not gonna be super big because eventually eventually people oh god uh people are going to care it's just going to take a while um hmm. Okay, so we just gotta do this, and then that. Okay, that was weird. Huh. I mean, yeah. Eventually, people will care. It's just the eventually aspect of that. Because, okay, so here's the thing. Like, I would say that I have more fun recording videos for Just Some Boys than I do Great Blue. Um, maybe partially because it's like, I know I don't really have the same stress of quality of like oh yeah we ha it has to be this good or else it's not going up mm. um which i'm wondering if we should enact but at the same time i don't think it would be necessary because i think it, it'd be hard to enforce it really at, would be you know with like saving games and stuff like if the episode wasn't good you'd be like oh okay i guess we gotta yeah let's let's play yeah. are hard in that aspect of like re-records aren't really possible if you're attempting to do any kind of consistency my suggestion would be i guess story-wise we could like write a little script to go along with it that way we're not having to like completely freeball it during the episode what kind of script would be right to go around uh with like, it? just the story and then like some highlights so we don't like Skip over stuff or something so it wouldn't just be so, live like, commentary it would just be it would it would still be live commentary it'd just be like footnotes basically for what you could say here's the stuff. problem with that is that like okay so take a channel like um game grumps if i remember correctly i i watched them pretty pretty religiously way back when i know all the things that they did were improv um they I, I think took classes on improv actually they took it seriously but um with that it's kind of hard to write a script if you're uploading so often because then you have to write even if it's let's say the script takes me 15 minutes to write and let's say i have um one video go up or even i know a lot of um of the the bigger channels will have two videos go up a day um yeah, it's so <laughs> not sure we could possibly enforce that um, because eventually we're going to hit the uh, the pronged fork in the road there where we either get a studio and do this for real or we quit because it's not our priority anymore. So, oh, finally the most broken plant in the game. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, that's... Yeah, that was Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's just something to chew on. But, I don't know. It, I'm not saying that I'm very confident in our ability to uh, get fame. A while ago, like a few months ago, it seemed more likely because we were kind of picking up steam. But now that's... We've been at 250 really since... Yeah, since, yeah, the, yeah, the, since the stream. But, I don't know, it's just, it's hard to market it. It's hard mm -hmm. to get people to get into There's not is, much you can really do. Personally, that's why um, I think compilations are our best bet. Because, obviously, you're not going to be able to pick one random episode to just slap out there and say, Hey, what do you think of this? Because it's going to be either the first episode of a long series, which no one wants to watch, a random episode of a long series, which no one wants to watch, or a one-off, which is not indicative of your channel. So, a fix that I was thinking that we could do for that <coughs> is, you know, it may be kind of difficult because we have a lot of finished series, but for each finished series we'd have, if the series was good enough for it, we'd have, like, its own compilation for that, that we would, like, just maybe. upload. Maybe. Because that way, you know, you get the highlights of it, you get all the good stuff, we could use that for promotion, 
Um, I would be on board with that. I, I, I that feel like work. I've suggested it before. I don't remember exactly, but um, it, it'd work. It'd do its Probably job. Probably would, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna pull up to this kind of slightly depressing... Oh yeah, you, you probably heard like all of that. Oh no, yeah, I've heard all of it. Okay, so it's not really a depressing I'm subject, it's more of a down-to-earth subject. Of shoes uh, of reality. Uh, you know, it's, it's a it's, realistic it's more subject. Realistic, we have yeah. to talk about it at some point. Um, Especially I mean, when we're on the finale of Even plans. if we decide not to, we're kicking the can down the road. We're, we're going to have mm -hmm. to bring it up at some point in time. So the, th the immediate thing that he said about, like, uh, uh, if the thing is good enough, making it its own series, uh, is kind of like a super cut. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that's essentially what I meant with it. Yeah, I get you. Because it would work. Probably like, would. if you send that out, people would watch it, they'd get a sense of our humor and, like, what we do, and then... I feel like that'd be a pretty good That's also why we need to do... We need to make the trailer. We need to work on we that. We need to make a good trailer, because the one that we recorded stuff for is awful. Oh, it's, it's already deleted. I needed space, <laughs> so we'd, we'd have wow. to redo it anyway. Thank you. Yeah, retroactive. Um, so this is... Yeah... I'm trying to decide how I want to go about phrasing this, or even if I do. Um, but allow me to be very cynical here for a moment. So, partially, I I think that I don't know how much synergy we have. I think that at times it depends on the game. I was gonna say it depends on the game. A lot of different is definitely. one thing, but it's like we can have good synergy, but like. How much synergy do we normally have because i know we can get into conversations that can be very interesting like this yeah well, this is this is definitely one of them but um i'm not entirely sure like i don't know we we have a lot of arguments a lot and pretty much during every one i i ask myself is this the point that the channel dies because a lot of times it does seem like it because one of us just wants to have nothing else or nothing to do with anyone else for and it hasn't happened yet uh, by some miracle of nature you're you're basically shooting into a crowd and missing everyone with that um fired i missed fired again and something missed. but it wasn't what i was aiming for <laughs> so, so i missed, I guess I missed. <laughs> passed out woke up with a popsicle sticking in my mouth that has got to be my favorite game grumps bit ever it was a good one like, I'll give it to the Game Grumps, that was good. But... <sighs> um, yeah. Uh... Well, I feel like if we worked on that, that one, it'd make seven. everything a lot easier. Two, especially outside of the channel. Three. Watermelon kills and three hits. That's good. But, anyway, it's like... I, I do like the idea of supercuts. I think that that would be a very and good way I, to introduce... I'm saying... I'm. Like, I know that Dalton does most of the stuff, but I would not mind taking on stuff uh, from time to time. Oh, yeah, don't get me wrong. I'd love to have, uh, <laughs> love I'm to have help cutting I'm not very good things. at, like, yeah. a now, lot of Now it. that we have all of PCs, it makes everything a lot easier. Um, if you just need to get me that Sony Vegas Pro. Haha, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we'll just pretend we're buying that. Anyway, um... <laughs> Which is, I also can make an entire argument on piracy and why it's completely moral, but... Well, yeah. at some point, it's not the fault of the consumer, it's the fault of the supplier. I was gonna supplier. say, when the only decent product is $700, and I'm a college student who doesn't get discounts from that $700, um, yeah. it, crime is the secret ingredient. Or, or in terms of, uh, well, that's very common today, is streaming services. Yeah. With how <laughs> diversified everything is and how spread out everything is, um, like, it has been recognized that a lot of the fault of the piracy comes down to... Steve Newell said that, uh, piracy is a service issue and not a pricing issue, issue, typically. What do we get here? But it's like... Oh, rip that sunflower. Yeah, it's gone. <laughs> Um, you left in the dust. Uh, just took fire. Oh, the boomer zombie. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but, um... I think that, like... It, also, our sense of humor can be very... Depending. It, it, it fluctuates. I try to, like, round it out. I know we have a lot of, like, sex humor, and we have a lot of, um... It's, it's no, just the, in particular. It's the easy. Millennial humor, it... 
Well, it, I, it, most of it, I will say, is just aid. I can't even say said. the phrase "low hanging fruit" because then it's like ha ha ha, ha low hanging fruit. It's like testicles. Like frick you. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 I, I get that. That's right. I, I I didn't. I said I I probably could say that, but do I want to say that? No. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, is it really better than not saying anything at all? Though? Yes. I was gonna say having we, commentary isn't really better than well is it is it not as good it as entirely not depends on the commentary being made yeah and plus if there's no commentary being made saying something is always better than nothing yeah that's why we have to learn how to improv well because if we don't we should all take improv class <laughs> don't oh why why wow that, why and now you're getting basketballs on the stretch oh my god some of the bull the crap in level? this game no this is the five nine five ten is the final level oh that's where you fight the zone boss yeah you do the so zone boss um zoom bomb level zoom 100 zone boss but yeah i'm not sure that our sense of humor can hold up half the time i mean you gotta think about our intended target audience well our age teenagers yeah and that's the thing is like if i had my say in this channel and i know my say is only equivalent to about half so I, it's like not even mm, quarter a good I old mean, third point three 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 i was gonna say i good old point i mean three point three three uh feet being yes it, that's you what might point three 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 infinity is. no okay uh no you won't frick i would put a squash there Okay. Anyway, Dolan, you were saying words. It's like, if I had my say in the channel, we would be a little bit more mature in things, but I also understand that both of you are in high school, so it's kind of hard to do I that. I can be more mature about things I mean, if you need me to. I well... Know, I know you laugh at that, but... We it's, also it's, have high school viewers watching, so I was gonna say, like, like I, I would shift our target audience, is what I'm saying. What do you mean Frick. by that? By essentially, like... I don't know. I, I feel like Let's Plays in general, there's no one that's going to actually have time to watch them but high schoolers, so probably well, that, for this. That entirely depends on uh, where you click that funky time speed button. Right. Because <laughs> I watch, most of the YouTube videos I watch, um, if you guys don't know, if you go down to the settings wheel, you can turn up the speed of the Why uh, would you YouTube do video. that, though? Yeah. All right. So I can watch you. Frick! So I can watch uh, all the content from the creators that I want to watch and have time to do so. It just, it ruins a lot of the, like, flow of things, though. Not really. If you, turn it, if you only turn it up to 1.5 or 1.25, uh, it's not that bad. Um, when it starts to get bad is 1.75 and times 2. Because sometimes in times 2 you don't even know what they're saying. But with 1.25 uh, and... Uh, 1.5. It's not bad. Okay, so bring it back yeah, to let's, the commentary. Let's kind of wrap this back around. As someone who interacts with our, like, in, in, in the, the people that, you know, watch our stuff. You're all talking about uh, the people who currently do. I'm saying the people that we want to watch our stuff. And I know that's like... I mean, we want... If we already have a demographic, we could just work on expanding that demographic itself. Because why, why search, why search okay. for what we don't already have, you know? Right, That I don't seems know. harder than what it, you know, what okay. it should be. Okay, there's a lot of green right there. Um, oh, okay. died. Mm, yeah, the watermelons are ridiculous. Like, they, they will bleed. I had this game on mobile, man, I know. Okay. Yeah, I didn't have okay. this game on mobile. Okay, okay. <laughs> hey, frick. Hey. Hey, hey, you awesome. Uh, you gotta I, here. I know. Oops. Tiny zombie, tiny <laughs> zombie. Bing Crosby, Bing Crosby. Uh, how, how do you propose uh, shifting the demographic? Yeah, let, me, let me adjust my monocle to read this note here. <laughs> Holy matter, you have failed to submit your rightful claim. Be advised that unless you comply, we will be forced to take extreme action. Please remit your home and brains to us forthwith. Sincerely, Edgar Zombos. Hmm. So, anyway. Post haste. Is that just Edgar or Vaughn? No, no Zom. Zom line. That is Zon. But, um, I hate to, like, compare this channel to, um... Oh, yeah, let's read this first of all. I know what his weakness is. 
You can stop oh boy, time. Is the <laughs> secret to to kick him in the uh hmm the press down right or no I remember it's <gasps> no. <Zone alarm>. no. <laughs> Wait, what did he say Kaku the first in. time? You have to kick him in the spleen or something like that. It was the pancreas. The pancreas, yeah, there it is. It would have been funny if it's like, I know his weakness, Holy know frick his weakness balls. is you have to stop time. Yeah, the, your roof is like insane. This guy can just stand on it with nothing. <laughs> anyway, you were saying. Um, but I hate to compare like just some boys to Great Blue a lot because they're, they're different styles. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but I, I run both and it's kind of hard to like ignore the experience that I have with one when transmitting to the other. And... I know for the f most part, like, I'm not going to say that I'm the most mature person on the planet, because I'm definitely not. But, oh, definitely not. Um, I mean, I'm not either, but... I neither of us are. Hey, it takes one to know one. Alright, let's get to the point. Um, I usually, like, the people who watch, like, the Great Blue stuff, they range. Like, there's they're a pretty diverse age group. I, I have people, like, I think uh, one of the guys that I was talking to said he was 19. Um... My uh, the metrics at least for what that's worth is uh, it says that everything is uh... yeah so we just gotta does it do increased damage when you freeze and then no well yeah, I think so I don't know cause... yeah I mean I guess I feel like most of the people who would watch TF2 are like older teens that is true because most either, people grew up you know, those. yeah except if you're like little Timmy with five dollar Walmart mic but I also <laughs> don't try to like be loud i usually try to keep things to civilized discussion for the most part trolling excluded um i feel like that's just who you are though that is more who I mean, you maybe. are yeah i mean if you look at around if you look at tf2 content okay. creation yeah, there's on youtube in general a lot of it is wait. messing around i guess he still does take damage when he... Yeah, so a lot of this is... Oh, yeah, that's the meter, by the way. This is health bar? Yeah, the the, the level meters is health bar. They, they did a fun job so with this game. So when it fills, it's done, or when oh, it my. goes away, it's done? I don't remember, but you just, just watch it next time it happens, I guess. I think it fills. There's the real boomer zombie. <laughs> um... Wow. Yeah, we gotta talk about the gameplay on our finale of this, but... Do we, though? Yes. I, it's it's just... the finale, yeah. I should have waited for it. <laughs> okay, so it looks like your basic run-of-the-mill bonus game, but it's the finale. One Watch thing that I didn't uh, don't exactly uh, like uh, about how they do Plants vs. Zombies uh, like finales is that they usually just do them like this. Like a scroll, and it's like luck-based. Ah. I mean, what do you mean by how they normally do them? Like, they've only done it this way in one game that matters. <laughs> what do you mean one game that matters? Like name name another Plants vs Zombies game. Plants vs Zombies Two. Yeah, so one game that matters. <laughs> Plants vs Zombies Two is actually pretty nice. It sucked. Why? Because it was by EA and EA sucks. So by property of association. No, but <laughs> it, it was pay to win. Some of the levels were stupid hard for another reason than buy our power ups. We need money. Oh my God, he just get got hit by. A I know, he's getting hit by everything. The bag of chips. Okay, so it fills up, so... Okay. We're Thank over half. Oh, so dang. Freezing him? Yeah, the, the sun... Or the uh, peppers. The red hot chili peppers. Red hot chili pepper. Oh, yeah, I forget hey, he does that. Hey, screw simple. you. <laughs> huh. Oh, yeah, your roof's also a freaking tank. If you can take... I know, I, I said that, too. It's like the... Throwing an RV and also the giant mech robots just standing on the roof. <laughs> like, was that crazy Dave's RV? Yeah, it was yes, probably. Wow. Hate to see it. Give me plants, you freaking. Just use your jalapeno. I'm saving those. Oh, splash damage from the melons. Oh god. Oof. Oof. You're gonna lose the power. Oh wow. I don't want to. All right. Basketball guys. You had to do what you had to do. I like how it's splash damage from the watermelon. Dude, the watermelons no, are. No, no, no. Yeah. I think you missed the pun there. 
Okay, back to oh, the yeah. channel for like one second. Okay. I, we do need to have a serious discussion oh, about all this slow. stuff sometime. It just doesn't have to be on an episode. Yeah, I would like maybe tonight or something because we are really good on time. Oh, yeah. Because tonight is, what is it? Got freaking. I still like to sleep at some point, though. Sleep is for the week. Yeah, and I am very weak. Well, we're just gonna- No, 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 no. Okay. Yeah. Mm. I feel like the health bar for the guys that drop down is- Yes. They- Yes. Okay, they can take as many hits as the cone heads, but they're there for so short of a time that it just doesn't feel like anything. Okay, this is why I wanted the uh, cleaners to survive for so long, because there is no Just chance. Use help. I'm waiting, because the next time he drops down, I have just enough to kill him. Aha. Uh -huh. Will I, though? Will I, though? There we go. Boom, and bang, that's... Planes vs. Zombies, wow. Yeah, The end so... of an era. We get to hear this Would you consider sound this the, uh, the the sunshine of this so, half of the channel's lifetime? Do they play uh, Don't Want Zombies on Your Lawn in this? Yes, they do, and we get to watch it. All right, so fun fact. The girl that sung this song also sang the outro for Delta Rune. The girl that sang the song, didn't she compose the music? Maybe. I don't know. What's her name? Do you know? Laura Shingara yep, or Laura something? Laura Shingara. She also did the... She sang the outro for Delta Rune? Boy. Yeah. When the light is red. Yeah. And the very short list of music that I've actually purchased, the original Plants vs. Zombies soundtrack is on there. Also, um, I don't know if you guys, like, ever watched any, uh, Minecraft music ever? No. When that was, like, a thing? No. <laughs> <laughs> There's a guy that went by the name of Slam Account, and I'm pretty sure they're dating, but he's, like, a really good animator, and he did a lot of, uh, Minecraft <laughs> animations. <laughs> and then she sang over a couple of those she also made she also has a game on steam called uh racklin mm -hmm. yeah I've, I've heard there are, she actually has two games that she mostly but, um i don't remember i just remember seeing it on her like band camp or whatever hmm. broke lovers of aether ding dong tree song outro whoa <laughs> zombies on your lawn this Even Walker, any of the Portal songs? Yeah, um, this hasn't really ever been a meme, but... I, I feel like this is a lot of meme potential. Watch, watch uh, Plants vs. Zombies get in Smash, and this is one the of the songs. The Pea Shooter? <laughs> I found Piranha Plant can do it. He stole Pea Shooters. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is something that's happening right now. I like the tall That's nuts. the suckiest defense ever. <laughs> Tower I like defense. your tricycle. <laughs> Commenting on background There's assets. on my head. Facing uh, the wrong direction. Not even in a lane. <laughs> I'm going to eat your brain. <laughs> Do the Necrocomicon. Do the Necrocomicon. <laughs> Do the Obamanomicon and just blow yourself up. Obamanomicon. <laughs> Nice. Do the Osama Bin Laden <laughs> organize 9/11? Uh, <laughs> if only 9/11 happened. The Did hottest. Mr. Roseberry still has the remember 9/11 yep, thing up. At, uh... I don't think I'm gonna be able to forget it. It's always there. There's always something you know, there to remind you. I think every year this is like a really hot take and probably pretty offensive to say. Like, nice. kind of something that I've kind of felt. I feel like every year that it goes by, 9-11 just kind of fades further and further. I mean, the people who are remembering it are not the people who are commenting on social media about it. I'm going to yeah. tell you that. Um, oh, I remember the corn cannon. Cop cannon. They're ridiculous. But, like, I just feel like eventually... Um, mini games. I, I feel like eventually there's just going to be a point where it doesn't matter. I mean, I mean, it's sad as it take is. Take D-Day. Take take D-Day. No one really talks about D-Day anymore. Unless you're in history. Okay, class. let me let me class. actually compare it to the Titanic because that's one that's like been memed into existence at this point. 
but it was like a huge tragedy back when it happened but it's like over time yeah the, the i feel like 9 11 was, was a lot worse i mean it was all. intentional versus the titanic but it's also That's a tragedy yeah. yeah i mean i mean i don't want to I just feel like it. I, I don't want to make anybody mad, but I just feel like that's how it's going. Anyway, right, we're gonna title this episode "Hot Takes." Thank you do for it. watching Plants vs Zombies. There is a chance that we may do two or three, one or two more episodes with the mini games and stuff. Walnut bowling is fun. If it you been an experience, I was say, if you want to see that comment, if not, if we don't get like any comments, we'll just comment and skip. subscribe, nerds. But yeah, thanks for watching. Yeah.